Asset Condition Manager allows you to access and adjust the data needed to feed your asset condition estimates. You're likely not able to inspect every asset every year, but condition information is an important part of decision making and work planning. In Cartograph, you're able to estimate the condition of all your assets based on the information available in Asset Condition Manager, an individual asset's work history and inspection history. So for any asset, you're able to see today's estimated condition, as well as the date that that asset is expected to reach its minimum acceptable condition. Let's take a look at where we set up this information and how it works. From the administration area, access Asset Condition Manager. The two main components are prediction groups and condition groups. For prediction groups, your assets are typically grouped by material type. For each condition category, you can identify the estimated condition by year to plot its expected performance. If two condition categories deteriorate at a similar rate, you can copy the values from one curve and paste them into the next for easy data entry. The weighted average of the condition categories generates the overall expected performance for this group of assets seen here in red. So based on the asset's age, we're able to predict or estimate its condition. For condition groups, assets are typically grouped by functional use. For each group, identify the minimum acceptable condition. So based on the asset's estimated condition and expected future performance, we can estimate the date it will reach its minimum condition. Once this information is set up, each asset is categorized into the appropriate prediction group and condition group, and you can view the estimated condition information for your assets. For the pavement segments in this district, we have set filters to visualize the overall estimated condition of the neighborhood. Only two segments are below average condition, but if I take a look at the segments which are marked as act now, meaning they're below their minimum acceptable condition, I can see there are a few more. Even though these assets haven't been inspected in a few years or perhaps were never inspected, I can still get an idea of their condition. Most assets have deteriorated since their last inspection, but assets that have work completed can show an impact or an increase in their condition. The estimated condition of an individual asset considers both completed inspections to adjust the estimate based on actual inspected condition of the asset, as well as the work history to increase the estimated condition when an activity has an impact that has been completed. Asset Condition Manager allows you to access and adjust the data that feeds asset condition estimates. So for any asset, you're able to see today's estimated condition, as well as the date that asset is expected to reach its minimum acceptable condition. Both can be key factors in decision-making and proactive asset management.